And when you really immerse yourself into a painting, you, you start to work with the paint and the water and the canvas and the brushes. It's the entire outside of the world shuts down. The stress goes away. Um, and I, I, my mind is empty. I was diagnosed with Hashimoto's when my second born was about two years old. She's now six. So for a long time, I was very sick. I was weak, I was tired. Things weren't working. My brain doesn't always work. I have tons of brain fog and they say that's, oh, it's your mom and all of that. Oh, you're tired because you're a mom. I, I survived the beginning parts of, you know, the, the young toddler stages. And then when I started to find out more information about it, I got healthier, I got more help. And they really said, one way to help heal yourself is through stress management, which is very hard, I feel, in our day and age. We're so busy, especially Americans, we're so busy and everything is just go, go, go all the time. When COVID hit, the world stopped and my body actually healed itself in that moment. And it took me back to a place where I had forgotten what that feeling was of being stress-free. And so it was kind of eye-opening. I was like, oh, this is how I remember feeling and I haven't felt this way in a very long time. So through that, I realized trying to slow down our lives, the world picks back up, here we are again, going again. But what has really helped me with the painting is it completely shuts off my mind. And my mind is just thinking about the strokes, the, the water, where's it going, this line. And it's such a meditative place. That is a very hard place I feel like to find sometimes. It's very hard to shut down your mind um, of the outside world. And this has always been a kind of a healing place for me.